Paul Mesco, welcome back to the show. The last time we spoke, you gave me and Andrew Scott the upside down Harry Bow Jellies trick. So thank you for that. It's changed my life. Very, very welcome. Happy to be of service. <laughs> now listen, we're all so super excited to see the trailer to Gladiator 2 later on today. Like, how does it feel to have this much hype about a trailer? I mean, like... It's new territory for me. I, <laughs> it's it, it's it's absolutely bananas. But like, I've seen the trailer, seen the film. I think from my end, the the hype is kind of warranted. And look, mm. I'm a, I'm a, as big a fan of the first film as as the next person. And I think um, it's just indicative of the 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 legacy that this film has. And uh, and Ridley Scott directing a second one. It's for people who love film. I think it's 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 a no brainer, right? It really is. And and look, I know we're seeing the trailer later on today, but what can you tell us about the film in terms of what's going to be seen? Because you've seen the trailer, you don't give us any spoilers. But in terms yeah. of what people will see today, I th I think what what they should expect is that it's uh, it picks the the world of the first Gladiator up and, and plants it kind of twenty years in the future, and. Uh, it has the same energy and spirit of the first one, but the but the the character's journey through this the mad world that is ancient Rome couldn't be more more different. Right. I think it balances a kind of honoring of the first film, but is very much its own its own beast, and it very much is a is a beast of a film. I can imagine. I can't wait to see it. I really can't. But yeah. I also, kind of, I do like the fact that in real life, it's been twenty four years since the first movie, oh, yeah. and we're kind yeah. of that length of time ahead as well. It's just kind of a nice marrying of real life and the movie oh, world absolutely. together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, and, it's very satisfying in that regard in terms of time and story. Yeah. yeah. And is it true that uh, that you reckon that playing the GAA helped you secure the role? Oh, look, whatever it took to get me over the line, <laughs> I'm sure. Look, I, I'm I'm well used to kind of throwing myself around on a pitch, and, and that that was useful in the in the Colosseum of ancient Rome for sure. I would imagine. Talk about the training for a second. Did you was there much that you had to do to 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 kind of become this character of Lucius and physically embody him? Did you need to change anything about yourself that way? Yeah, I had to eat a lot, I had to put on a bit of stone, really? had to lift lots of heavy things, run around. But like, I I had a team of people around who are telling me to eat what when run where run how far lift this heavy thing for x amount of times yeah um but look i i i, I love the kind of act of having a like when, when you're talking about films of this scale you have a team of experts around you who support your entire process so yeah. it was kind of a dream come true with that like there was no stone left unturned with that kind Amazing. of part of and hair, makeup, beard, was that all natural or did you have any? Uh, any... It was all natural, <laughs> believe it or not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Grew out the beard for what felt like 10 years. Um, the Yana and Juliana who did hair and makeup on this were just extra. And their work in the film is next level. Like, yeah. So it's lots of lots of blood and dirt covered um, yeah. Sweaty men running around for for two and a half hours. That's what we're so. all. That's what we're all looking for. Um, <laughs> yeah. From from an, just from a, an Irish man's point of view, like you know, going from sausage ads to gladiator. Like, do you do you yeah. know how proud we all are of you, man? Like, seriously, this has just uh, been such an amazing journey. No, it's like I I've said this many many times, but I feel like incredibly proud to be Irish. And like as you said, going from sausage ads to this wasn't in the bingo cards for me. <laughs> And to feel like uh, me and Andrew Scott both spoke about this coming home to do the All of Us Strangers premiere last year, I I, I think it, like I'm I'm absolutely biased, but I think we've got the most extraordinary country and people who are deeply supportive of the artists that we have, mm. and we're kind of as a country punching far above our weight in terms of the output, and long may it continue and and. It should be supported because we've got immense talent for such a small country and um i definitely feel like an overwhelming sense of support from 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 people back home and i, I can't wait to take the film there to be honest listen paul thank you so much congratulations on the role of lucius and gladiator 2 and later on today we can't wait to see that trailer thanks bud see you soon cheers see you later bye 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 bye, -bye.